Welcome to Good Mythical More. It's time for the heavily debated draft of baked potato These are fun. toppings. Fun. Uh, but first, you know what? Let's give Becca $50. Becca. Just, Becca was out there in the wild sporting that merch. Hashtag merchicality. We found you, Becca. And you're going to get $50 that you can go over to mythical.com and spend on some more merch. Hashtag merchicality. All right. Make that tag so we can. Uh, Come on in, Jordan. So you can get your bag. Hello. Yo, what's up? How's it going? Good. Oh, we're so good. I already ate a little bit of baked potato okay. um, at the at the start of the shuffleboard game, and um, I was like, man, I want to keep eating this baked potato. I love that. Baked potatoes are so good. Oh, so, at okay. Wendy's. So you're a big baked potato fan. Yeah, okay. that's right. my order at Wendy's. I get a baked potato. The thing oh, about baked potato okay. is that good to know. It's you know, it can either be underdone, sure. or they can be overdone. Yeah. And so there's like a sweet spot, or just right. And then they they do it just right pretty much every time. Yeah. They have a system. How's that one? Feels feels good. This one's a little firm, still soft. Yeah. And we're going to draft. Oh, man. Are we and gonna then, are we gonna do what we typically do? What we make these as we go? We're gonna make them as we go, and then Jordan is going to decide. Who, who? who has the superior? What was the last thing that we did? It was... Burger? Burgers. And you ended up picking my burger at the end of the day. I yeah. did. So my rodeo burger was you too get, much. You get to go first this time, Link. I think that's how it works. And sure. all of these things are sport favorites? Yes, we love all these things. So in theory, you can only make a good baked potato. Okay. There is steamed broccoli up there, though. And of course, if you want to be reminded of what the best baked potato toppings are, when you go to Spork, you can just search baked potato, and then all of the top toppings will come up. Um, I mean, there's some Mexican cheese, there's some mozzarella cheese, so I feel okay either way there. Uh, I will never pick black olives, jalapenos, taco meat. Yeah, but huh. what does Jordan Chili. like? Isn't oh, yeah, that what this picking, is about? Oh, yeah, I'm picking this we have to you. remind Link each time that this is not about what he likes. But when I go with what I like, Jordan likes it because Jordan likes black olives. Jordan likes me, and I like Jordan, and we both like baked potatoes. We both like, as I discovered last week, we both like the same type of eggs. Yes, we eat our scrambled eggs the same. Soft scramble with cheese and onions. Yes, but. You don't like black olives. Jordan does. I would say I I agree with a lot of the things that Link thinks, but then also expanded. I think I gotta go. <laughs> right. Is that a nice way to I say I would it? say that's true of most people. <laughs> <laughs> I think I gotta go with the Mexican four cheese blend yeah. to start things off. But is that gonna put it on the bottom? Because that's also a factor. Well, you'd rather have it on the top? No, I wanna have it on the bottom. So this is me down here. And then, because I want it to start melting. Okay, well. This is our number one best shredded Mexican cheese. It's very fine, which makes it great. Yeah, and I'll say I love that you're putting it on the bottom. I think the cheese should go on the bottom of everything. A hard shell taco, a baked potato. I think the burger, if you're not melting the cheese directly onto the burger, you should put it on the bottom of the bun. Yeah, that's a good point. Okay, that that is a big, no, that's, that's a big blow. There's that's no, a big blow early in this game. I'm sorry. Are you, you assuming that, that we both get butter though? Because butter's not up here. Uh, just pretend. Pretend there's a base la layer of butter. We're assuming that we both have butter, um, so, or that neither of us have. I've got to go with the shredded mozzarella, uh, simply because if I don't, you might do a double cheese situation, then I'm dead. Yep. Yeah. In the water. Because so. that would be delicious, and if you had no cheese, that would be really bad. Right. So just, I'm going mozzarella. Yep, our best shredded mozzarella. So you both have best cheeses from sports, so let me taste, that's good. Let me taste a little bit of this out of the ramekin. The fact that it's so finely ground makes it very meltable. Yes. Whoa. This stuff is like flat noodles of it's good. I can tell it's good cheese. Right it is here. good. You really packed it in. You pressed it down oh. into the potato. I want to make a, I want this to receive <laughs> everything else that I'm planning for you here. Wow. Yeah, that's kind of what I did too. I, I love that. Made it more receptive. Yeah. yeah. Other stuff. I think you're both doing a great job so far. Okay, Link, you're up. Mm, see, if I go, I'm, if I go with taco meat, then I'm leaving the chopped bacon. But 
but with the chopped bacon, you got like, you can go with broccoli, you can go with the sour cream, but if you go with the taco meat, I might be going for more of a, I think I gotta stick, since I'm with Mexican cheese, I've gotta go taco meat. Wow, okay, so are you doing like a Tex-Mex baked I potato? Am. Yeah, I'm doing a Tex-Mex baked potato. I'm All very right. intrigued by that. I feel like I have an opportunity to, to uh, put a dent in your strategy here because what I would do at this point is chili. Because with that, I'm getting meat and beans Interesting. in one go. Wow, hmm. okay. You don't seem to be enthusiastic about this, Jordan. No, I'm very excited. I think that sounds we have delicious. Can? I thought this chili, oh, I can tell you what tell this me about chili this. is. Denison's was the favorite. Yes, it's our number one chili on our chili list. It's so good. It's really thick. It's meaty. The beans are perfectly cooked, which I think is something you don't find in all chilies. It's delicious. Mm. And I love it. And I think this baked potato looks delicious. Just when you said you were going to do a dent in his strategy, I thought you were going to take sour cream, jalapenos, avocado, something that goes with a Tex-Mex baked didn't. potato. And then you didn't. You're right, you're right. There's a lot of meat in there. Yeah, it's good. It looks very meaty. Very good. How is that? Do you want to try it? You can try it. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I guess it's I want to try it. Let's see how good this is. Are we chili with beans or no beans? Oh. Beans Me too. all the way. Oh yeah, I mean, you not want beans. Not on a hot dog. Or a burger. I still want it with beans. Uh -uh. I love, but I love beans. Anytime I post anything where I'm eating beans, everyone comments and it's like, oh, are you going to Rhett's house? Hey, see, wait, eh. <laughs> Link's daughter going to Rhett's house. We're the old bean bandits. Yeah. That's us. We've got things in common too over here, me and Jordan. I think I need to take that sour cream before you do. Give me that Horizon Organic Cultured right. Sour Cream. And let me tell you, the sour cream Dang. is delicious. Dang. It's perfectly sour, it's perfectly creamy, it's rich, and I love sour cream. Yeah, I, 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 did, a, I, love it. I did a bad thing here. And when there's because no Because I should have thought no ahead of time. I should have thought, whoa. Yeah, you're starting to get it. <laughs> I should have thought ahead of time that you would have not gone for chili, right, having already put meat on there, but I'm just, I'm learning, I'm learning. I like though that you're going with your instinct. I feel like something you do is you always make a thing that you would want to eat, and I really admire that. Mm. Even though he was taunting me for doing that. <sighs> no, I thought you would like the chili. Me? Yeah. I do like the chili. Yeah, you're always very respectful of me. Oh, gosh. Look at that. Somebody's gonna get stuck with mm. broccoli. That's, that's just a waterfall of... And since Link went first, it's probably gonna be me. Um, where you going now? Crumbled Cool Ranch tomatoes. I know you like uh, 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 the jalapenos. Are these just sliced or are they pickled? They're just sliced. Sliced fresh. They're sliced. Which is not as great as pickles. Unless you're Jordan. Give me them jalapenos. I like both. I like a pickled, jalapenos. I like a fresh. Fresh just has such a good crunch. Yeah, they're good. Better watch out with that heat, though. Mm. You might get a hot one. That is nice. Mm. Oh, you're not gonna hold back, are you? Hmm. Wow. Okay. You're both really starting to capture my essence. I'm really <laughs> thinking that I need to grab these this avocado. That's gonna be a nice, I need some green. Okay. I need some green. How about I the need, broccoli? I need some color. The broccoli's so green. So I'm gonna take I'm gonna take that wow. put it down here. This is um, this is really working out. You, you ever gone to like a wedding or some sort of event and they had a baked potato bar? I've never had a baked potato bar, but I've had a mashed potato bar where they serve it in like martini glasses. Okay, but it, okay, maybe that's what I'm thinking of. So it's the same thing except yeah, yeah, yeah. instead of it being a baked potato, that's a wonderful. Incredible. It's easier just to scoop it. Yes. I have no desire to have a traditional wedding, but my girlfriend and I are like, we should find somewhere to do a mashed potato bar when we get married. Oh, yeah. yeah. Maybe no a, wedding, maybe, just. Maybe ax throwing? <laughs> yeah, well I'll go ax throwing and then we'll do a mashed potato bar. Yeah, like same venue. Sure. Mm -hmm. Do you wanna plan it? Um, Sounds like it. I, I'll DJ it. Okay. For free, as a gift? Oh yeah. Nice. Definitely. 
Okay. Yeah, I am not of the caliber to be paid. <laughs> you just need to be okay with like long periods of silence. That's okay. Yeah, like <laughs> struggle and figuring out I buttons. Think that's but fine. I, and you know what? I need another gig. I'm um, going with uh, to, just to get back in the game. Okay, I'm ready. I, I'm I'm getting the bacon off of the board. Oh, I I could always have used that bacon. Okay. This is chopped bacon. You've highlighted your favorite bacon before. Is yes. it the same or different? I think it's the same bacon. It is the Coleman Natural Hickory Smoked mm -hmm. Uncured Bacon. It good is, God, what's wrong with you oh bacon gosh, sugar? Sorry. Look how mad he it's is. Not you, it's Jordan. so good. It's this. What? <laughs> this is like three stooshes kind of thing happening back here. So like every time I put one on, it just goes off. Now, Link doesn't like real bacon bits. He likes the ones that you get in the can at my house in 1987. I do, too. Bacos? Let me tell you why, because my parents don't eat meat. So I grew up not eating meat, and Bacos was like an incredible fake meat product we could have. I didn't know it was, I just thought it was other meat. What is it made? No. It's made out of no. like. I'm sure it's like textured soy yeah, protein yeah. that's been like dried out with like liquid smoke yeah, on it. That, you were getting tofu back in the day, and you didn't even know. And okay. I was just. I love it. They're so crunchy. All right. Is it my go? Yeah. Yep. <laughs> don't want that. Don't want that. I don't care about that. Give me the crumpled Cool Ranch Dang, Doritos. I was trying to hide them. Which is a nice. <laughs> you did kind of put it with that your is, stuff. Yeah, that, was, that was all my strategy. I love there. that. That's sneaky. Such a nice crunch. That's what we need. And now I'm at the familiar point in the process of you like to stop. Wishing I could just hold. Yeah, this does can't, look incredible. Though, but you can pass right me the black olives. Okay. <laughs> Why did you look at me like that? I'm just surprised. Why? I didn't think that's what you were gonna go for next. I and thought you were really gonna try to stick him with the black olives because he hates them so much. Delalo. I'm thinking about you, Jordan. Wow. I've been thinking about you. I love that. This is looking, this is looking like. These both look really good. This is blowing McAllister's out of the water. Oh, delicious. I love McAllister's. I hadn't thought about McAllister's in quite some time. They're, yeah. They, they'll give you a a tater this big. Yeah, put chicken tenders in it and stuff. Yeah, it's a bit much. Yeah. I, don't, I don't, I don't. And now I have to choose one of these black beans. That's still safe. So I gotta, I'm gotta. i sticking you with the broccoli. Go ahead and bring that over for Rhett. And I'm going to do a little strain and, strain and throw here. I don't want a lot of the... Listen, this is what I'll say. There's a little broccoli on there. There's a little broccoli, and I also think broccoli tastes good with the cheese. I think the chili will cover it up a little. I think frozen broccoli can be a, a tough sell, but with the jalapeno and the chili and the cheese and the bacon, I think it could cover it up. Yep. Would you like me to make you the perfect bite? Yes, please. Okay. I'll, I'll <laughs> Don't assemble, say it begrudgingly. I'll okay. assemble the perfect bite over here. It might have a teeny bit of broccoli in it. Yes, that is the one technical rule. You do have to get a bite of everything in it. Wow, these both look so good. I think it's such a big bite. I'm genuinely so excited. I have a huge mouth, so it's fine. You ready for that? Yeah. I can put my whole fist in my mouth. <laughs> well, let's see that. Really? <laughs> um, sure. <laughs> Do you really want to see it? I don't know. Maybe maybe people should vote. Like, I'm like, I don't, I feel let's like. put it on Instagram. <laughs> Do you want to see Jordan's fist? In Jordan's face. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know if the whole audience wants to see it, but I'll show you after taping either open, way. Open wide. I'm I'm, a, I'm I'm adding a little bit more at the very end here. Okay. Open wide. It's gonna go to the. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm mhm. Mm now I'm gonna try. Wow. I'm gonna try it a little bit. So let, much it, let it settle. So let much, it settle. So much sour cream in it. A cream. Dorito. On a baked potato. There's a yeah. lot. There's a lot to love. I gotta admit, there's a lot to love over there. That's unbelievable. <sighs> the avocado. I'm kind of like, I don't know if you're welcome here, but oh, everything really? else is. I think it's like good. I don't think it's adding anything. It never does, really. I mean, texture. But you don't. You already have so many things that are already kind of that texture. So my only note, if I were to make this again, I would make it exactly like this, maybe with no avocado. But the Doritos, wow. Never eat a baked potato again without crushed up Doritos on it. Yeah, that's pretty great. Unbelievable, okay. I'll, I'll let you feed yourself because this is a, it's a fork that You has, lose points for this. Is, I mean, I'm just saying, I don't want to stab the back, I don't want to stab, stab the back of your throat. Okay. That's like a, that's a strange explosion, man. 
Are you choking, laughing? Um, or... is, it's, it, is this I, it for you? Are you dying? I really was like, yeah, I've always wanted to die on camera, so it's perfect. Um, <laughs> I've always been like. Today's a good day for that, I think. To die today? Yeah, go what? for it. I don't know, I just feel like you're on a roll. So just go out on top. Okay. Die, Jordan. <laughs> I want to see, you know what? I want I'm you like, to what are you trying to get out of? You want, your me own to, fist. you want me to die? die. No, okay. I, I kind of want you to stick around and continue uh, like offering really good opinions about packaged foods. Thank you. And saying things like, I'm Jordan, a professional food taster. That's and, so sweet. And, and then getting getting the clicks. And then coming here and being served wonderful foods. I kind of want all that to continue. I, so I, 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 I don't want you to die. Just take that into account when you're so judging sweet. these two potatoes. And it does I, you add know, to the taste of your potato. It, the only reason I want you to die is because your your dramatic return would be pretty amazing. I Absolutely. Mean, like I would rise from the dead at this desk, like three days from now covered in Cheeto dust. Yes. <laughs> and then you, you would go on to live a second life of sport tasting, ranking, and just um, pithy behind the scenes moments. That's true. Only on but TikTok. then you'd have people like followers at that point. Like, I mean like religious followers. And you have to deal with that. You'd have to give them things to do. Okay. If you die and come back from the dead, you're gonna have people who want to worship you. Fist chokers is what they would be called. Uh -huh. I have a lot to think about <laughs> after this. Yeah, think about it. Right now you need to think about Whose is better? Well, luckily I don't have to think about it anymore. What I will say, both are really incredible efforts. Um, <laughs> we both tried hard. You, and you, you know I somebody's think, really losing when you have to go to think, the effort. I think you both played it really smart, really strong. I think you both did your best. Um, that being said, somehow even with the jalapenos and the chili, all I tasted was black olive and frozen broccoli. Yeah. And I'm so sorry. This is so much better. I just tasted it. I so would good. buy this at a restaurant. Link yeah. has made a perfect baked potato. Mm -hmm. mm. There it is. Time to die. Oh, before before she dies. Come on, just go to sport. Let's just, let me just hold you. They talk up. all about these toppings small hand. and more. Oops. You don't even have to think anymore when you go to the hand. grocery store. Go to sport.com. I have a little hand, but I'm a big person. Why is my hand so... Do you want to try to do it? I, I could try to I, do it. I could easily... Try to do it. What? Try to do it. Yeah. Try to put... My fist in your mouth. Yeah, do it. Okay. Okay. This is something that we both want? Yeah, 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 sure. yeah, 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 yeah. I, I want it, too. All three of us do. Okay. Uh, yep. You got... Open wide. Show them what you got. I mean... You were acting really confident. There was a so. little bit of a... <laughs> there's strategy to doing it. There, there was some, uh, there's some, some, some tater in there, probably. That's fine. It's fine. You sure? There's probably stuff on my hand. Okay. <laughs> okay. Wait. It, no, it smells fine. It smells, yeah. it smells great. I wash my hands a lot. My mom's a nurse, so she like enforces yeah, yeah. that. You can't get hand herpes, can you? <laughs> Are you that implying is, I have hand herpes? That is glee. I think I just glee. That's not what I'm saying. Okay. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this is amateur hour. Uh, you got to get that part. We need to shoehorn that side of his cheek over there. Are you biting down? <laughs> shoehorn that part. Of it. Get it in there and open it up. Open it up right there. Okay, wait, and then I'll do mine with my other hand. There you go. Oh, he got it. Boy, I've never felt more like a third wheel. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh god. Don't put the pull out. Put... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cut away before I the really, pull out. He really bit me a lot. I really bit Why were you biting down so hard? Good God. <laughs> I was just shoving it in there. You <laughs> Draft your own dream baked potato with help from Spork. They've taste tested all the top tater toppings, so all you have to do is draft your topping team. Spork.com.